Hello, my loves. I'm Laurel, and welcome to Laurel's Moon and this bitch. Join me as I read you your life, baby. Thank you to everyone who has liked, shared, commented, subscribed to my channel. You already know I appreciate each and every single one of you motherfuckers. Yes, I do, baby. And if you need to get a personal reading from me, make sure that you hit that description box down below and check out my website, laurelsmoon.com, for any other magical purposes and deviation workings and things of that nature. So, Spirit, you are welcome in to this reading. You must sage the cards for all of the gods. All right, my loves. This is going to be a message for the... 28th through the 29th to all my loves out there. Just the overall vibes and energy coming and stepping into a new motherfucking day and atmosphere. So let's see what's going down. I already had some pre-shuffled cards that were pulled, but I did not turn them over. I wanted to see them for who they truly were, baby. Once I turned them motherfuckers over. So I wanted you to be watching along with me as we get the message for the next couple of motherfucking hours in the atmosphere baby so very first card that i have is dream so shout out to primordial um tarot for these lovely cards go check out her channel there could be a dream that someone is seeing the truth towards okay or some of you guys are holding a lot of gifts in your dreams that are going to be coming to you in the next couple of hours. Okay, you might sometimes not remember your dreams, but there's definitely something that's coming to you. This could actually be a physical form of a dream that's coming to you. But I definitely see that things are getting ready to thrive. Okay, this is thriving into greatness here, growth. That's definitely what I'm getting. And there could be some luck on your side, baby. This is either good luck or fortune coming your way. And I also have construct, baby. So you already know as a spider web, they construct webs and things for the future, baby. So I see that you're definitely weaving and making things, you know, a little bit more smoother for you. Things could be natural, naturally woven, okay? But I'm seeing that there's some abundance and luck coming to you very, very soon. Okay, this just could be in your spirit, your spirituality. But I'm definitely seeing that you have a lot of luck coming to you. Things could be definitely straight. Things could be curved at the same time. But I'm seeing that you're still on your path. All right, that as you're constructing certain things. Now, your dreams definitely could be important to you for sure. So let's get a few tarot cards for the next couple of hours in this motherfucker from wherever you are, baby. Let's see what's popping. All right, very first card that I have here is the Six of Pentacles. So I'm definitely saying for some of you all tomorrow, there could be um, some appreciation, okay, or some generation or giving back that you might be of influence to other people. This could be people who are poverty stricken. This could also be generosity of fairness and balance when it comes down to your life every single fucking day. Who's equal giving and taking that you're giving, okay? But I feel like there could be a raise or some salary money that's coming your way, baby. All right, but definitely some sort of appreciation here. Now, I feel like some of you guys with this two of cups, Either you and your partner are sharing some love or there's going to be some appreciation between you two that I feel like you have tangible relation with each other, baby. Okay. <laughs> this could be a link or a tie between you and your partner. But I'm seeing also that there could be some sort of sudden changes where you're coming to see the light or you're seeking some sort of light or a new inspiration, some wisdom or some knowledge here. I have the high priestess, the hermit energy, the tower. 
So I'm seeing that uh, your spirituality is definitely heightened here, okay? And that's what your dream world is all about. There could be a lot of downloads, a lot of, a lot of spiritual downloads that are coming to you. I feel like um, for some of you guys, there's something that is thriving here. And this could be something that you've anticipated. This could be something that you've been dreaming of. But I feel like there is something that's getting ready to thrive in abundance and in luck. Now, for some of you guys, I'm definitely seeing that there could be some withdrawal or some trust that you're needing to see in other people. Or some, if you feel like it's a mistrust, you need to see some sort of harmony is what I'm getting here. Okay, so you have a high priestess, page of cups, six of pentacles. You definitely could be dealing with um, getting to that money. King of pentacles, two of pentacles, knight of pentacles. All right, I'm got, I got three different pentacle energy here. This is getting to the money paper chase. That's what I'm seeing here, ideas with this king of pentacles of how you're going to strategically plan your finances, things in the things in the at the forefront, things in the past. I feel like there's definitely something coming up that you're going to be outweighing your options, or you're going to be simultaneously making things work for you. Okay, so let's take a look at your love life, baby. Real quick, I'm going to use the romance angels. Here we go. Very first card is retreat. Okay, so there could be some time alone between you and your partner where you're gonna have to disconnect from the motherfucking work. Okay, you're gonna need to be alone. Don't let nobody in. That's what I'm seeing here with this, <laughs> with this retreat. I feel like romantic feelings and making the effort. There's somebody who's gonna have to make some real effort here. Okay, and the real feelings are real, baby. So there could be something a little bit deeper worth exploring between you and your partner that you haven't gotten to know there could be some things that you feel you need to rush into things but you still haven't quite known your partner or there's a little bit more intimacy between you two that it's going to take to really get you there to that level that you've been expecting okay but you got chemistry here too so i feel like things could either be uh you know getting to you or wanting to get to that intimacy, okay, or that infinite parts of you. That's what I'm seeing here with romantic feelings, retreat, and make the efforts. So, you know, there could be times where you might be having to run out of faith, or you feel like you're dealing with a soulmate that you're running out of faith with. I feel like for some of you guys, you definitely see the ups and downs in life with the soulmate energy because when you get black and white, you know, you're going to see it all, all dynamics. So I'm definitely seeing that you're going to be getting to your finances, a lot of abundance and luck, a lot of new journeys starting. Okay. When it comes down to you getting to your finances, but I feel like there's a lot of potential coming up. Okay. A lot of desires. Now, some of you guys need to stay hydrated. There could be some water that you need to drink, or you need to, um, really think about in your memory, and in your knowledge, what you need to give back, give to your body, okay? What you, How you need to preserve your body. But I'm seeing that you guys have a lot of potential coming up in the next couple of hours. But it's definitely saying here that you got a romantic love that you're going to have to retreat. There could be an engagement here as well that somebody is planning or thinking in their head. I've noticed that a lot of people have been getting married or are thinking or contemplating some sort of marriage here. Or it could be that you're trying to focus on what is positive and what is healthy to you in connections and relationships, okay? But I'm definitely getting um, Ace of Pentacles here. So there's some money off us, baby. Okay, this is that abundance. Talk to me. Let me clarify this Ace of Pentacles. Could be some money offers, okay, some new gateways opening up when it comes down to your financial inventory, baby. <laughs> I'm also seeing there definitely could be some sort of divine wish that could be granted here. That is what the Ace of Pentacles is all about. This could be for some of you guys, you got the King of Pentacles here once again. So this is confirming it, okay? I feel like a lot of you guys are thinking about your material items, material possessions. This could be things that you're holding, like I said, in your inventory, but you definitely have an offer, a new gateway that's coming up, some sort of money. 
Okay, for sure, baby. It could be on its way to you in the mail to your address with this four of wands here. Also could be something that's going on within your um, romantic life, okay? That somebody's trying to see the silver lining, okay? They want to feel that cashmere, baby. So, <laughs> let's see. Here we go. Give me some more information some of you guys could have blocked a third party situation off i'm getting with this king of swords four of pentacles some of you guys ain't taking no shit okay you could be dealing with virgo taurus definitely a taurus here with this four of pentacles but i'm definitely seeing that you guys are cutting the situation off you laying down your own fucking laws with this king of swords so i see that a lot of you guys could be just ending situations some of you guys need to take a fucking break, sit your ass the fuck down and think about what you really want in life. Who's really going to be there for you? Okay, or is this permanent? Is this up and down? But I feel like for some of you guys, this could be with a Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, some sort of third party situation. So let's see what's coming up. What's coming up for my subscribers in the next couple of days? Talk to me, spirits. We got the Ten of Cups, okay, and the Eight of Swords. So there could be something that's worrying you or you feel like you're limited to something. But I see the outcome being happiness, honey. Some of you guys need to get the fuck up out of your head. You might feel in cage. You might need to go listen to some music. You might need to go have a fucking outlet, all right? But there's definitely some sort of abundance coming up. You know, you got potential. Some people need to see that. You need to see it in yourself as well, too. So I do feel like with the Knight of Swords here, you're definitely thinking about, um, you know, this in and out feeling. This could be mentally in your head with all of these swords here. But I'm getting with this justice energy. There's going to be some balance, baby. Okay, you could be dealing with a Libra. I'm also getting Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, Ace of Pentacles, once again, Ten of Pentacles. So this is definitely paper trails up in this bitch, okay? Like I said, somebody's trying to feel uh, the lifestyles of the rich and, <laughs> of the rich and famous, baby. So, yes, honey. I feel like some of you guys are trying to avoid, uh, you know, people that could be plaguing you. That's jealous, watching you, watching your money, watching your finances. Five of Wands here. Don't play with me. Okay, some of you guys are ready to come out of that, um, you know, that lower level energy of dealing with people. And I feel like with this Empress energy here, you are definitely going to be standing in your nature. But you ain't going to be taking no shit either with this Page of Swords here. You need, you probably need to watch out for a Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio with this Moon energy here. Somebody's emotions, okay, their emotions going up and down, some sort of secrecy as well. But I feel like for some of you guys, you're not going to be taking any shit coming up with this Page of swords here okay there could be some research or there could be somebody who's doing some research on your motherfucking ass but i'm saying that there's you know definitely a um i feel like there is somebody who's holding some secrets here you're going to come into some sort of manifestation with this magician here and you're definitely manifesting that potential okay this could be you doing a lot of things for show okay show and tell <laughs> This could be somebody that you're trying to show and tell some things, but I feel like with this Magician Six of Wands here, there's some magical ass shit popping off in your world, okay? Now, this could be in your environment, in your universe, whatever the case may be. I feel like some of you guys are definitely thinking about your success, okay, coming up. So, definitely think about how you're manifesting changes that are coming up, leaving third-party situations behind, secrets as well. Um, I feel like you guys are going to be cutting people off. There could be somebody who's definitely spying on you. But with that Ten of Pentacles, okay, Ace of Pentacles, I'm getting a lot of you guys have new beginnings if you're concentrating on that eye on the prize, okay? So, my loves, I'm going to get on out of here. If you need to get a personal reading from me, hit that description box down below and check out my website, therosemoon.com for any other magical purposes and deviation workings and things of that nature, baby. So I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.